Hey everyone, Shaggy PS here. I had a suggestion and an idea, so I went ahead and did it because everyone that knows me knows I don't have an alt. But today, I do. And the reason why is because with the update for Sorcerer Fighting Simulator coming out, I'm going to show you all how, if you want to prepare like I'm going to show you on this, how to go from noob to pro in FSS in preparation for the update. So, let's get right to it. Sorcerer Fighting Simulator. And yes, I'm starting it muted and everything because, uh... All the music and everything, I can't really do nothing with the settings that way in the game until I can get into it. Brawler as always, because that, that's what I started with when I first played. And I just like the idea of being able to, like, bonk hammer. Okay, now that I'm in here, I can do this. Yes, if this is your settings. It's, if you're brand new, you can come in here, you can turn the music off, adjust your screen shake, you can fix... I'm not sure what fix rolling is. And that's your manipulate power. Staff slamming, you'll learn as you go. Rank notifications, and auto trains with the game pass. I like having my music off and my screen shake off. And now I can come up here, if I can click, and turn on the sound at least. But, yep, then my friend JB, he's always in Gem War, and this is my friend Saneko as well, or Sane, or Velk. He actually joined me, and if you want, Sane, you can go ahead and say hi. Or, yeah, that works too. But, alright, from noob to pro, I'm just going to go through this real quick and give you a rundown of the basics. Your character screen comes over here and brings up your stats, powers, change magic, ranks, quests, energies, skins is for your staff skins, map, which is extremely helpful for anyone that ever wants to know where their next training zone is. See, do you see where it says choose map filter? Click that and say, oh, gee, I'm a brawler. And my mouse would move. And it literally shows you where every training zone is. And I mean, it's not an exact location, but it's, it's close enough that you can do what you need to. But, other than that, contracts is automatic. There's contractor building out here. I'll show you probably in another video. Groups is for your friends. Stores, if you want to spend your Robux. Rewards are for all the codes. Ooh! Which reminds me, I get to enter a bunch of codes in a video because I know all of them that are out there currently, I guess. And then, of course, we went back to settings. But to start this off, I'm sure you've seen this in other videos. You just follow your arrow up here. And talk to your buddy Mark. Welcome to Sorcerer Academy. Here you will learn the roots of what it takes to become a master. You will need to do a series of tasks and training missions for me to prove that you are worthy of learning here. These techniques will also be used to defeat evil, aka the void, so master them well. You have been given a quest. Check your quest in the characters tab over here on your left and hand it in to me once you've completed. And Ah, uh, that's energies. Comes down here, quest. Exclamation point. And yes, Sane's a tester as well. Or Vilk. I'm not going to go through the quests and everything right now in this video. I'm just trying to give you guys a feel and I'm going to let you know that I, I am going to go through this. So you're starting magic. You want to come out here and talk to that trainer. Mine's Riot. He yells at you all the time. It's kind of a meme in the Discord. It's awesome. You need to complete your first quest with her before you can begin trading with me. 
So, after you complete your quest up here with Marm, you can go out there and start uh, talking to the different trainers, and at any time, if you don't like your starting magic, you just click this thingy up here, click view, and you can change between any of the starting magics before you even do your first quest. Like, I've seen so many people say, Oh, I screwed up! I'm stuck with this! I can't do anything until I finish my quest! No, you, you can literally change your magic at any point of the game from joining. At least within the first four. Or if you bought Creator and had the game pass, you, you could switch to that, but... I don't. But, yeah, you see Jets here already showing off all the brawler magics I'm going to work towards, but Jeb, Zane, and NPC Marm, thank you much. I'm going to see what people think of this, and then in the next video, I'm going to continue on with the quest, and I'm going to show you what needs to be done, but I'm going to grind on this overnight and get this account ready for that I'm not going to do any quests but the next time you see my alt account it's going to be quite a bit stronger than it is now because over here in the character tab you come to stats all you have to do is do click 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 and click I haven't even done one quest yet and when I actually do a staff swing or a push-up my stats are gonna go up a whole lot faster but for now let me know what you guys think and I'm gonna be a lot stronger in the next video and we'll get some quests out of the way and I'll show you if you have an auto clicker on PC just how easy it is to become a noob to pro in SFS and this will get us ready for that update that's coming, guys. But, till next time. Ask Marvin for some tips, like Jeb is. And, get ready for this update. Hope to see you guys there. Bye.